Cinda Sales here, and welcome to another episode of Cinda Tells TV. So we're talking about the th the five things that you need to know if you're thinking about buying a home that are the most important. The first one that we hit was the pre-approval letter, and that's how we get financed, because without financing, we can't buy a house right. So you should have been able to do a buyer consultation with your realtor and they will explain a lot of these things, but this is why I'm giving you doing this video for you so you can kind of get an idea ahead of time. The next thing that you're going to want to know is uh, you've gone out and you found a home that you want to buy and you're excited about it and you've already got your pre-approval so your financing is ready, but we got to, we have to put money down. So we have to show good faith to the seller that we're making the offer to that we have money to put down towards that home so they can see that we have credibility. They know we're financed now they need to know that we're gonna have some skin in that game. Today's market is a little challenging with earnest deposits because back in the day, maybe we could put down $500, but now the, the, the sellers are really looking hard at what kind of money that you're putting down uh, as a down payment. So that makes help them make decision as to whether or not they even wanna take your offer. Um, we could really get into the weeds with this, but basically I just want to tell you that the earnest deposit just means that you're putting down an initial amount of money. Let's say on a $300,000 house, you're going to put $5,000 down. There's no percentage number, anything like that, that we use here in where, where we sell. Some parts of, this, of the world they do, but we don't. It's just whatever we think makes a difference to the seller when we're proposing that uh, offer to them. And that money goes towards your down payment. So if you're gonna put $20,000 down as a total amount down, 5,000 of that is gonna to go to earnest, but it's still gonna be 20,000 when you close that house. All that money goes towards that. Okay, I hope that explains that. And next up, we've got more to offer, so stay tuned.